Hey, how's it going? This is the Argonaut, and we are here again in the Mario Campaign, Episode 6. Um, so, what has happened? Well, I've skipped ahead a few turns, just because nothing really interesting was happening. Um, I had my army down south. I decided I'm going to scoot up here, because I can keep replenishment range, and then I can swoop in and try and take Hagar, which is what we're about to do. We defeated this army in battle, just another typical fight against them, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to attack oh. them, and hopefully draw their garrison into the fight. Um, and that should be good enough. Uh, so let's see what happens. Um, and also, if you haven't subscribed yet, I'd really appreciate it if you did subscribe. Hit that subscribe button for the Argonaut, for the Mario campaign, and for victory. Also, it's just, you know, that'd be pretty cool if you did. I'd appreciate it. Uh, all right, let's get into it. So, yes, excellent. All right, they have some archers, which we'll have to take care of. Um, but aside from that, then the elephants just can just run roughshod over these fools. Um, these guys should be pretty easy to take out. So let's fight this out. All right, so we move first to take on this small army, and then we'll attack their garrison. So uh, we will quickly move in here, I swoop around, take a little javelin fire. Forgot they had javelins. Um, but we're plinking away at them, and then uh, soon I'm going to start saving my ammo, and we're just going to charge on in over here with our cavalry. Nicely done. Elephants rumbling forward. And we have the bodyguard cav. All right. That we have to take care of. They they fled from their own troops like the cowards they are. Uh, didn't mean to throw some javelins there. Probably got some friendly fire, but okay. So now we are going to line up and get ready to receive their uh, their large garrison here. All right. So they fire away at us. We're gonna fire back at them. Hopefully, taking out their uh, archer units. We have a good amount of kills. I pushed them back a little bit with our cavalry. Over here, these uh, Arabian horsemen got a little too close to our javelins. All right. Archer fire pouring in. Doing well so far. All right. Took out that unit, and then we're going to start swooping around. Elephants out in the woods over here. Just firing away. Plink, plink, plink. Hoping to route the last of them. Start targeting this unit, which is going to net us some good kills. And they're getting shredded by the archer fire. And with that, they move in. Alright. So, we're going to push forward with the infantry. Move back in with the cavalry. Try to find the general. Um, wherever he's hiding, the coward. We are going to get some nice charges with our axemen. Same with these guys on the flank here. And let's see how many kills they got. 20 on the charge, 31 on this charge. Pretty brutal. Alright, so we engage all across here. And then the general moved in uh, out of cover. We do, um, <laughs> unfortunately, intercept the charge with our light cap. And they're going to get smashed by the general. It was 98 charge bonus on him. It was brutal. Alright, so... Charging back in with the other cav unit. Should be able to knock those guys out. And then the elephants rumble forward. Let's see how they do on the charge here. They're at one, 124 right now. Okay. Come on, I know you're tired. You got it. <laughs> there we go. Oh, it's just so good. 190 kills. Beautiful. Break the center of their line, and we're going to start to roll up on either side. Over 200. Oh yes, beautiful. And those uh, those axes did a good amount of work themselves. All right. Are we able to keep chipping away at these guys? Going to charge back in here. Nicely done. Should knock those guys out. And we've won this flank. I'm going to start swinging around. This uh, light cab came back. Um, the one that got hurt pretty bad by the general. So, going to get some vengeance here for its lost brothers. And boom, break them there. And we're just going to break this entire battle line. A few more repeated charges. Elephants, over 400 kills. Over 500. Yep, there we go. And voila, going to chase them down. And that is a victory for Moria. All right, success, as expected. Um, let's see, captured a good amount of enemies. 
let's go ahead and kill the captives because we want the garrison as small as possible. And then let's go ahead and let's just assault. There we are. Um, okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna quick save. I'm just worried about losing these guys. 70% of our force remaining, that is not very good. Nobody's gonna be on the walls, which is certainly interesting. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna fight this out real quick. I'll, uh, I'll show you on the, on the actual battle map. All right. Um, so I lost a good amount of elephants, unfortunately. Um, and uh, yeah, it was sort of an interesting battle. Um, the fleet was able to get in through the, one of the doors and they just had so many archers, I couldn't deal with them. I couldn't get to them all. Um, but we took a good amount of damage. So I guess it was pretty accurate uh, auto resolve, but regardless, we took it. Um, so from here, I think we have some options. Um, I'm kind of thinking of liberating them though, because though we'll probably end up having to go to war with the liberated settlement, um, having an ally would be huge. And that way we can, uh, we don't have to move into a new province. We can focus on the same province and take the other walled settlement that these guys have. Um, so I think we are going to liberate them. At your command. All right. Ready for now what we're going to do is scoot back down. And uh, let's see, we have a good amount of money now. So I really would like to get some, some of these camels. Um, pretty good melee attack. Really good charge bonus. Let's, uh, yeah, let's grab a unit of those. They're expensive, but... That's all right. Um, now our money troubles are still an issue, but uh, Greetings, most let's get some trade first. Be at home and speak as you oh, good. Their economy's strong. Great. Fires. All right, let's get a good amount of money. Oh my goodness! All right, let's get that, and uh, that's about it. Okay, sweet. We so Saba only has these two territories now, wisdom. which is good for us. Um, all right. Does anyone now want to trade? Welcome, friend. Nope. Okay. Uh, at least we are replenishing now, and things are looking pretty decent. Um, we have a ton of money now, which we are not going to use for really much of anything. Uh, we could go for this. No. Yeah, we might as well upgrade that. That's an extra 300, but it decreases banditry. Lowers recruitment costs, and it gets us all the fancy stuff, which I want desperately. So let's go ahead and build that. Um, all right, cool. Well, that went pretty well. Um, we've si significantly hurt the power of Saba, um, and they don't have much left right now. So things are looking good. War target, the faction rises. Yep, 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 yep. Cool. Uh, any rank ups? No, that's surprising. All right, lots of replenishment going on, and we're looking good. All right, uh, we are, you know, attrition as usual, uh, but <laughs> that's okay. We're gonna scoot all the way down to here, um, and then probably swing back around and attack. So faction destroyed, all right, and a faction rises. Okay, so. Oh, they still uh, they still have enough money for three armies. Wow, that's amazing. Wow, pretty cool. And a freaking giant fleet, right? Is there a giant fleet over here? There is a giant fleet. That's just so impressive. I'm so... <laughs> I hate them so much. It's your service. Um, all right. Well, I think what we will do... Has many faces. Let's go ahead and sabotage the these guys. Forth, the all right, opportune faces. failure. Not terrible. And we're going to patrol. That helps with our income quite a bit, which is nice. Ooh, we should uh, deploy this guy here too. I thrive on ledgers and accounts. Alrighty. Um, we want to tax these guys? Ooh, we can. Yes. All right. Money's looking good. Money's looking very good. Uh, I just want to know why you guys are. It's just all the raiding. It's just it's just terrible. I don't know how to combat it. I can't get any uh, other agents. I could get another force of someone who is going to help with public order. 
Um, so I guess we could do that for now. Let's let's go for it. Uh, let's see, somebody cheap. Two forty-two. Okay, let's go for these guys. Ready for battle. All right, and uh, we'll let him chill there for a bit. Hopefully, get him to experience, and then he can. Uh, Ooh, we're almost up next turn. Sweet. All right, let's end the turn here. All right. Uh, obviously, took some attrition, as we usually do. We're going to keep trucking down this way. We'll go like this, and we're looking good. Um, all right. So, at least their fleet moved on and didn't continue to raid us here. Uh, we are got positive public order now without the fleet, so that's good. We might grab two troops here just so he can also patrol and increase public order. Um, I think we're going to scooch him over here just to keep him a little bit safer. And then, uh, as for some cheap troops... We got all the cheap troops. Who's the cheapest? You're 83 points. Ooh, 50. It is a great good. And all right, we're looking good there. Um, cool. All right. Well, I think that's going to. Oh yeah, I forgot. <laughs> all the armies. It's all the armies here. Uh, let's see. Good. Thirty percent chance of success. Twenty-eight. And thirty. All right, we'll go for the front guy here. Ugh. Keep failing. Please keep failing. Let these three stacks continue to get closer. <laughs> At least we'll have a pretty sizable defense. Um, hopefully we'll be replenished by that point. We shall see. I am skeptical. They move all of their armies out to face us. Alright. Well. Um, I think at this point we are going to end the episode. So thank you so much for watching. If you liked it want to subscribe, please like and subscribe. And I will see you in the next episode of the Moria Campaign where we contend with these three armies of Saba and hopefully finally go to take Marib.